Okay, welcome to another edition of East LA Sports Scene as we continue in our coverage uh, with our coverage of the Garfield Bulldogs in Eastern Conference League play as they take on the third place Southeast High School Jaguars, the fourth year of existence. Their overall record nine and seven, league record three and two. And Coach Rivas has the Garfield Bulldogs on a roll. They're in second place in the conference. So stand by, get ready, strap in, lock up, and get ready for the this edition of East LA Sports Scene's High School Game of the Week, Garfield versus Southeast High School. We'll be right back with the tip. Okay, welcome to the East LA Sports Scene's High School Game of the Week as we bring you Garfield in white, red, and blue numbers and trim on their jersey and the Southeast High School Jaguars all dark blue with white numerals and trim. So here we go now, Garfield controls the tip. Marco Mejia, number 15, he's the trigger man, he's the point guard, he's gonna make everything happen for Garfield. He draws the foul there on the drive as we're just underway here at the opening tip coming to you on this very, very, um, uh, it's a nice winter day here in the city of Los Angeles. We come to you in from East LA right now in Garfield on the campus of Garfield High School. There is the first layup of the game, taken by number 32. That was Jonathan Roldan. He's the center for the Garfield Bulldogs. Ball knocked out of bounds, and it's going to be put in play by number 33. That's Edwin Chavez. Chavez looks for Coronado. And Hiram Coronado, the first. Bucket of the evening for Garfield. Ball is now caused to be knocked out of bounds and they will put the ball in play here for Garfield. Garfield taking advantage of some turnovers here early. Coronado again. Oh, he was wide open, put it off the backboard and didn't get the bounce. Here we go the other way. Southeast turns the ball over to Garfield Mejia quickly into the front court. Oh. He Look for his wingman coming down the side there. That was Mike Partida. And Mike was out of control and luckily did not draw the offensive foul. He didn't have the ball. It could have went either way. Referees decided to let that go and let them play on. Here we go now with a Southeast, the Jaguars, fourth year of existence. It's a brand new LA Unified School District High School located between Southgate and Jordan High School. Three and two in their conference play. They're coached by David Clay. David Clay, the head coach. You'll see him throughout the, the, the game tonight. We'll be putting the cameras on both schools and their benches. Jump shot taken from the corner. Rebound back to the southeast. He'll draw the foul. Number 35 there. Heads up play. And that's Miguel Camberos. He'll go to the line now to shoot a pair of free throws. Just underway here in the first quarter. We played one minute exactly. Seven minutes left in the first quarter of play. High school basketball rules very quickly. First one's good by Camberos. Four eight minute quarters of stop time. There is a shot clock in California with 35 seconds on it. And uh, there is alternating possessions. Second one no good. Two to one in favor of Garfield. Shot taken by number 25 on. Danny Koo rejected by Roldan. Roldan says, not here, not now, not tonight. At least on that particular play. Southeast, the Jaguars down. Penetration, Camberos outside. Dumps it inside there, ball stolen by Roldan. He comes up with it. Very quick hands on defense by the coach Rivas. Garfield Bulldog, there's Mejia. Look for that all night and throw in some three pointers. And he should come up with a nice game tonight. Marcos Mejia, shot taken. Rebound snatched down by Roldan. 6.30 left in the first quarter. Four to one, favor of the Bulldogs. Oh, a running layup. Missed on a first attempt, but put back in. That one will go to Edwin Chavez on the putback. The first shot was taken by Kiko Chavaria, number 20. Two-pointer there by number 22, Rich De La Cruz. 
Six to three, favor of the Bulldogs. Mejia dribble drive up from 10 feet, short on the rim. Rodon's working the boards, both offense and defense. And Cometos comes up with it. Left-handed dribble, oh, and he'll be double teamed there. Chavez, along with Mejia, putting the double team on the dribbler, but it was last touched by Garfield. Let's try to set the Garfield defense for you. Up on top is, oh, before we set the defense, there's a three-pointer, and that's good. Brian Gonzalez scores tied now at six to six with that three-point shot there. Rolled on, 16-foot jumper, hits the side of the rim. No good. Camberos good behind the back dribble. He loses Mejia. That should be a good matchup. Two quick guards. And then right there, 22, Rich De La Cruz gives Southeast and the Jaguars the lead here. Eight to six, five minutes left in the first quarter. East LA Sports Scene's high school game of the week coming to you. Rico Cabrera along with Eric Sarney bringing you all the action from Bulldog Gymnasium. Bad shot taken there by Mejia. Didn't draw iron. Camberos quickly into the front court. Camberos dishes it off after the penetration. Here comes De La Cruz, dribble drive, puts it up, and oh, in! Six points there now for number 22, Rich De La Cruz. Mejia walks it into the front court, dribble drive, face left, goes right, dishes it off to roll down, roll down back up to Mejia. Eight foot jumper, straight away good. 10-8 now, favor of the Southeast Jaguars. Camberos now pressured by Mejia. That should be a good matchup all game long. Oh, nice dribble, nice pass from Camberos. Found his center down low. It was a wild shot. He found number 52, Pete Rodriguez. Ball was shot over the rim and ball's awarded to Garfield. In their own backcourt, here comes Marcos Mejia, number 15, averaging about 16 points a game now. Left, right, crossover, back up on top. Partida takes it 15, uh, eight, 18, let's call it an 18 foot jump shot, and it's good. Mike Partida. First points of the game for Partida. De La Cruz now, guarded by Partida. De La Cruz says, let's run something, guys. Left hand dribble down the lane, picks it up. Number 23, oh, three pointer. Good. Brian Gonzalez, he's a. The three-point specialist, he's got two of them. And the score now, 13 to 10, in favor of Southeast. Oh, nice pass to Mejia. Oh, beautiful penetration there. Kiko Chavaria, give him credit for the assist. Mejia, the basket. Six points for Mejia now, very quickly in the first quarter. Running and gunning like the UNLV running Rebels. Garfield comes up with it. Three minutes left in the first quarter. 13 to 12 in favor of Southeast. Mejia left-handed dribble around the screen. And they're gonna call an offensive foul, team foul against number 33, Edwin Chavez. He wasn't totally set there, referee didn't like that. Whistled them for a foul, he'll be replaced now. Coming into the game for Chavez is Tommy Torres, number one. And number three, Richard Carranza for the Garfield Bulldogs. De La Cruz, left-handed dribble, penetrating. Oh, almost travel, dishes it off. Number 11 is Ricardo Juarez. And here comes an offensive foul. It's gonna be charged against the dribbler, Brian Gonzalez. Referee is looking at the advantage and disadvantage here very early in the game. Offensive foul on each on each team so far. One was team and one was player controlled. Very different in the way that they're officiated. Mejia, oh, look out, puts it up and in. They're gonna take that away as right in front of him, in front of the basket, number 22, De La Cruz, held his position. And Mejia went airborne but came down on De La Cruz who had established his position. 